What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and I'm back from my 4th of July vacation. I had a really great relaxing break, and I hope everyone had a wonderful week as well. Today, I want to talk to you guys about the next operation called Apocalypse Z for Blackout Battle Royale. Now, we do kind of know that the theme for the operation is going to heavily focus on zombies, which I think is pretty freaking awesome. But Treyarch is going to reveal everything regarding the operation tomorrow on a live stream, which is set for Monday at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. And they're going to be revealing the new updated Blackout map here as well. But Treyarch did give us a little bit of a teaser on what the map is going to look like and I'm going to have it on screen for you guys right now. Obviously we can't really see much or, or tell much from the image but the river on Rivertown is like blood red and then of course we can see a dead tree. Um, a very very eerie map we're going to be getting come next week and again it's going to be relating to a zombies theme. Now we do have some easter eggs as well on this theme because in the recent days of summer update for Blackout there are very Various locations around the map that look like a massacre happened, one of which is even in the loading screen for Blackout. But because of a recent leak from Josh Wu Cool, we know that pretty much what's going on is the dead have risen and they're out looking to kill. I'm gonna have the leak down below in case you guys want to hear the audio, but basically it's like a emergency broadcast from the radios which can be found all around the Blackout map and it's pretty creepy, very very eerie. Definitely recommend you guys going to uh, watch that audio or listen to that audio because you know it's it's a pretty cool little storyline that Treyarch is um, building here with Blackout. Like some of the quotes that the guy reads off in the broadcast is uh, gonna make your skin crawl so definitely do recommend checking that out guys. One of the quotes I like to read off is, the dead are smacking against the door. It's only a matter of time before they make me one of them. If you see movement outside of your shelter, defend yourself even if the infected appears to be a friend, a neighbor, a loved one. That person is already gone. There's no reasoning with them. All they do is kill and those they kill continue the cycle. So it doesn't really take a genius to know that a zombie outbreak has happened in Blackout and I think we're gonna see more locations that have the same bloodied massacre when the map update finally does go live. Alongside maybe a few new locations from the Black Ops Zombies universe, definitely some broken buildings, doors removed off the hinges, and yeah, basically just a typical zombie outbreak environment. And I'm very, very excited for this operation in Blackout, guys. I, th I think the zombies theme is gonna be pretty cool. Um, we may also see like a new game mode. I was thinking that it's going to be something like Infected from um, from Black Ops 4 and some of the other Call of Duty games where if you die by like a zombie then you become infected and you have to kill the rest of the players in the game. So I think it's going to be like a Blackout version of Infected. Um, we're we're going to see that as like a new LTM mode. So uh, that's my theory guys. And I don't know, maybe in like regular quads and some of the other game modes we could see like zombies come out of the ground and maybe I, I guess force people out of the circle. I don't know. Um, that could definitely be a possibility there. Um, but again, guys, we are going to get more information about the Blackout update come tomorrow on Monday for the live stream. Again, I'm going to have all the links and times down below for you guys, along with the audio leak for Blackout Battle Royale. Um, please tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments, guys. What do you all think about Apocalypse Z for Blackout Battle Royale? And yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you all so much. Till next time, I'll see you later.